Today I'm going to be talking to you about some really unusual plants. These are generally referred to as myrmecophilic plants, which means that they have a close association in the wild with ants. Now a lot of people when they hear that they say, I don't want that plant, it's going to have ants. Well, they have a very specific species of ant that lives in them in the wild. And those, plant, those ants are not here, so they won't have ants living in them now. But they're really unusual plants. They have this caudiciform, you know, or bulb-like base. Inside is hollow with a series of tunnels and chambers that look just like the inside of an ant hill. It grows that way naturally. It's, it's a plant that produces a house for ants, and that's actually what its name means. This is Hydnophytum formicarium, which means formicarium meaning ant house. They're really a pretty simple plant to grow. They like shade. Uh, they like a lot of moisture. I grow them just like this in a hanging basket with uh, sphagnum moss. They do very well as long as you water them a lot, and uh, they'll just continue to grow. They grow these little orange berries, and if you were to open it up, there's one seed inside. That seed will sprout in less than 24 hours if you were to pop it out and put it in wet stack and moss. One of the fastest sprouting seeds I've ever seen. Here's another fun little one. This one is Myrmicodia. This one is uh, an epiphyte. It's much like the hydrophytum form of They don't get quite as still have because it's a small base. And inside it will look just like the Myrmicodia. I, I really find these to be fun. They're uh, easy to grow. They're epiphytes. They'll grow on the side of a tree in a while. They get quite large. And it's just an unusual addition to a collection if you have room. I don't grow them in a greenhouse. They do better in a greenhouse. But as long as it's tropical enough where you live, they'll do just fine. They don't need a uh, hot, steamy environment. Mine's doing quite well just in my yard. But I think if you enjoy an unusual plant, this is a great addition to any collection.